The big countdown to Christmas is on, and here at Burton TV News, we're going to be talking Christmas trees today. Uh, the real deal is over here on my left, because like me, I am the uh, real deal. I'm Dave Child. I'm Sue White, and I'm going to be talking about artificial trees. Artificial? <laughs> Like your good self. <laughs> no, Dave, there's nothing artificial about me, as you well know. Only my tree. Artificial tree. Ladies and gentlemen, we need you to take this really, really seriously. You're going to be sat in your lounge or walking through your hall or wherever you're going to put your tree. You need a real tree. No, 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 no. It's artificial every time. It makes perfect sense. You can bring it down from the attic or the loft. It's ready in five minutes. No mess, no needles, perfect. No mess, no needles. So, are you worried about a few needles? Of course. I don't want to spend my days hoovering up, do I? <sighs> I want my tree ready to go, just like this one. She looked the sort of woman who would be actually hoovering up all day. More likely to be watching Jeremy Kyle, I think. I can't believe you said that. Uh, excuse me. This fine specimen of a tree, uh, well, there are five actual trees. You could go for the non-needle drop one. No need for the hoover. It can stop in the corner. Not that you use it very often anyway. <laughs> beautiful smell, unlike that frosty thing out the loft. It's <laughs> beautiful. Look at it. Yeah, I'm you looking. Can, you can even get one of these air freshener things that you plug in so that your artificial tree suddenly becomes smelling beautiful <laughs> like one of these What's real What's all this ones. stuff here? This is snow, Oh, Dave. I thought it was dandruff, Sue. Well, I have to say... Or perhaps I shouldn't call you Sue because that's supposed to be like snow, isn't it? It's not Sue White, it's Snow White. <laughs> yeah, so, OK, if I'm Snow White, then you've got to be one of the seven dwarfs. I'm not happy. Exactly, grumpy. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, where could you get your real tree from? That's what you're wanting to know. Well, there are various places. You could go down to Tesco, they do them, of course. Uh, B&Q, uh, they do a good range as well. Chapman's, they're started at around about seven quid, which is pretty good value. Or you can go to the Croft. Five different varieties, and they start from about seven quid. And they're four foot high, the ones for seven quid, but they go right up to around about 50 pounds. Uh, my fine specimen over here which I'm very much in love with. So, what sort of money are we going to pay for one of these artificial things? Well, for instance, this one, which is about six feet, two years ago, £46. Pounds. 46 But that quid. was half price. I'm not surprised. Yeah, so you can pay quite a lot for your artificial tree, but you shop around, you will get one cheaper than that. The range, for instance, they're doing them fairly cheap at the moment. Oh, well, what about somewhere like Poundland? Oh, a pound. <laughs> a pound! And what sort of a tree are you going to get for a quid? A Not little a very one. big one, yeah. No. yeah. Uh, now, look, artificial, real. Now, how's your fairy going to feel with a chunk of plastic uh, strategically placed? <laughs> <laughs> very uncomfortable, yes? <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm sure she'd prefer the waft of pine. Well, I don't know. Those needles can be a bit prickly, no, can't they? No, Not no, sure I no. fancy it. Oh, well, you're only going to be stuck on a tree, are you? Let's be fair. Well, that's just rude. No, you'll be uh, you'll be busy brushing this artificial snow up. Well, at least I won't <sighs> be busy hoovering up the needles yeah, day in, day out. Yeah, and right. then what are you going to do at the end of Christmas when it's bald? It's got nothing left. It's served its purpose and it will be recycled in the proper manner. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll retire to make our own decision. She'll go back to her artificial bits, which doesn't <laughs> surprise me in the slightest. Meanwhile... Just remember, it was me, Dave Child, that gave you the real deal. And it's me, Sue White, that gave you the artificial trees every time. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. <laughs>